what's going on guys witness the fit here um, I'm off work today so I'm gonna take you along with me everywhere I go everything I do uh, welcome to vlog number two all right so first things first breakfast time I uh, I'm gonna be making a flat out is what they're called um, it's gonna be ham and egg um, or egg white rather with uh, low fat provolone cheese on top. There's uh, provolone cheese, ham, there's some uh, low fat mayo on it. And uh, it's actually fairly low cal. So I'm gonna put the egg in the microwave and uh, we'll go from there. Egg's already in there though. That's a quarter cup of egg whites. I believe it's two or three egg whites in total. Put that in for a minute or so. All right, so the egg's almost done. I'll throw that on the flat out here in a second. And uh, I'm also gonna show you the protein shake I made. It looks delicious and it tastes even better. So, <laughs> all right, I believe the egg's done. Yes, it is. And that spice is, uh, it's just mustache. It's uh, chipotle seasoning and it's zero sodium and zero calories. So if you don't have it, get it because it's delicious. It uh, turns bland things like eggs into something heavenly. <laughs> Alright, so I'll throw this on the sandwich and I'll show you the protein shake. And here's the uh, end result of the flat out. Um, gave you a picture of that. And also, I have a protein shake here. It's a chocolate peanut butter protein. And uh, I would have filmed this, but the magic bullet is ridiculously loud so I uh, just add some ice cubes into it um, some skim milk just one cup and uh, mixed it all up and it turned into almost like an ice cap sort of consistency um, I think next time I'm gonna add some cold coffee into it give it uh, a nice little you know element to it switch it up every now and then you know you don't want to keep things simple or at least too simple all the time well, I'll scrap to take my vitamins this morning. I got these, uh, they're Vitafusion, uh, male, um, vitamins, or they're gummies, I guess. These are it right here. But, uh, yeah, I gotta take those, and then I'll get a quick shave, and then, uh, might go out and get a haircut today. Alright, just about to head down to, uh, get my hair cut. I got my, uh, my Quest Bar with me. Um, just a quick tip, actually. Um, when you're out in the car and you find yourself hungry, um, I personally I know the drive throughs are the most convenient thing ever, but that's where you get most of your calories. So if you have a Quest bar or, or any other kind of bar for that matter that's, you know, a protein bar or even a granola bar, um, you can get that in you, fill you up, chug down some water and you're, you're good to go. So again, that's just another quick tip, but uh, yeah. Let's go. Oh, it is some nice out today. Just gonna go to the car and then we'll uh, mosey on down to the barber to get my hair done up and then uh, I'll check back with you when I get there. Hey guys, just got to the barber now. Um, I don't think they want me to film in there so I'm just gonna uh, this is a before and here's an after and there we go got her all trimmed up ready to go hey folks just sitting at the park I uh, stopped for a little snack I got my quest bar and uh, I also picked up one of my uh, guilty pleasures it's a uh, <coughs> sugar free white monster I don't have these every day so before I get any negative feedback on that, um, I do treat myself once in a while. But uh, actually, a quick thing about that, um, I had one at work one day, and uh, one of my coworkers came in from smoking, and then he proceeded to tell me how bad energy drinks were for me. Um, needless to say, I brought up the fact that he just got back inside from smoking over 4,000 chemicals, but... Uh, he was pretty quiet after I brought that up. Not that I'm saying energy drinks are good for you, but if you're going to treat yourself once in a while, 
go ahead and don't feel guilty. So anyway, another tip with these quest bars. Um, if you ever find them um, too chewy or anything, just uh, put them on the dash of your car while you're driving in the sun. And let me tell you, that is so soft, it's going to be delicious. Um, it'll more than likely be similar to throwing it in the microwave for 10 seconds, which is also a nice thing you can do uh, when you're at home. So yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna eat this. Um, this. This log's almost turned into a day of eating, but uh, again, I don't like to label these too much. Um, you're just hanging out with Trav, witness the fit, so... Anyway, I'm gonna check back with you. I think we're gonna I think we're gonna go to the car wash. It's such a nice day. Uh, I might as well shine up the old Ultima. What's going on, guys? Just pulling up to the car wash right now. Just give me a sec here. Don't want you to see my credit card number. Put that up. Yeah, gotta keep the old car clean. Actually, funny story about this. Um, we had our friend in the car wash with us uh, probably about a year ago, and uh, she asked us. Uh, more or less if these three different colors of uh, detergent came out on Easter and Easter only um, needless to say I was in stitches laughing but um, she's probably gonna be mad at me for putting this in the video but shout out to you Sam <laughs> but yeah alright so car is gonna rinse and we'll have a quick dry but uh, I'll take it I'll take the car to the park and we'll do the final inspection. I know not all of my uh, day is very exciting, but uh, like I said, let's keep this raw and uh, you know, just uh, show you what I do. Not too shabby. Alright, folks, so we're home now and uh, I just want to show you a pair of shoes actually I got uh, yesterday for the gym. That's uh, I think it's called Soak, Soaking, uh, Soaking, I think they're called. Anyway, there were I needed some new gym shoes because the Trev was just wearing down on them, and um, I actually have a uh, a torn meniscus, which is a torn cartilage in my knee. Um, it it takes a long time to heal if it does heal, so uh, footwear is very important for me. Um, so yeah, these are, I believe they're 179 plus tax, but they're worth every penny so far. I, I tried them on, they're, they're quite comfy. Um, I also got Jessica, uh, Jessica's gonna lose it on this Instagram. You've seen her in the previous video. She got herself a pair of, uh, either New Balance or Nike shoes, but they look really comfortable too. Um, so yeah, these are, uh, these are the sneakers I got. All right, folks. So I'm just about to uh, prep some chicken breast here, and honestly, this is all I do, and there's nothing to it. I put a little bit of pepper on it. And then that Chipotle mist dash I was talking about earlier. I don't know. It says zero calories and zero sodium, which is just awesome. And that's all there is to it, really. So I'm going to chuck them in the oven under on 400 degrees for about 45 minutes. And that's it, folks. That's what we'll be eating for supper. And uh, we'll have a salad with it, too. But there's really there's really nothing to see on salad. Seen one, seen them all. Same thing for chicken, really. But Hey, guys. Just about to eat some supper. All right. So this is what I have. It's... um. Some chicken, lots of broccoli and carrots with a little bit of uh, uh, spiral noodles into it. Okay, it's roughly 500 calories and uh, about 50 grams of protein. 
So that's, a, that's always a plus to fit lots of protein into your diet. So basically, I'm going to destroy that plate of supper. <laughs> and then uh, I'll go ahead and uh, start my pre-workout and uh, we'll head over to the gym. All right. Alright folks, so uh, forgive the lighting inside here, but it's starting to get, starting to get darker. But uh, looks like it's time to get some pre-workout in me. And uh, I'm just going to get some Icy Blue Raz today, the C4 uh, by Cellucor. Um I'm actually about to order some uh, C4 Ripped. Uh, it's cherry limey flavor. That's actually my favorite one so far. So uh, my friend Doug at Campus Protein is going to help me out with that. Um, I'll probably order that within an hour or so, or actually maybe right after the gym. Anyway, so I'll uh, put some more pre-workout in this, and uh, we'll be on our way. That's the uh, icy blue raz right there. almost instantly blue it's pretty good stuff um, it was also recommended to me to try that in uh, like a club soda or carbonated water basically so I'm gonna give that a shot too at some point I might pick some up at the uh, the supermarket tonight so I'll, uh, I'll give this a shake and uh, do a little pre-workout chug not bad okay so yeah um, that's that I'm going to jump into the car now, got her all cleaned up today, you guys know, so it's looking pretty good. Still got a back in the inside, but I'll save that for tomorrow. tomorrow. I'll be off work tomorrow as well. Also, some other uh, plans for another video tomorrow, so uh, stay tuned after this, and uh, I'll uh, see you when I'm in the car. Back from the gym now, um, pretty tired, uh, I wasn't able to film in there today, uh, it didn't make a difference, it was cardio, I, uh, it would have been boring, <laughs> but uh, good news is I worked my butt off and uh, I burned 803 calories, still out of breath, which is a good sign, <laughs> um, I think I'm going to wrap it up now, uh, I believe it's quarter after nine now, getting a little tired. Um, I do have a little something planned for tomorrow. Uh, it may not be as long of a video, but it is uh, going to be something different, so that's nice and refreshing. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, yeah, like I said, I'm going to wrap this up now, but uh, if you could like, comment, and subscribe, that really does help me, and it does help the videos a lot. Uh, you know, like I said, it gets that gets the name of Witness the Fit out there, and uh, helps build that community that, uh, that I'm hoping for, that I'm striving for, really. Um, yeah, so like, comment, and subscribe, and if you want to go the extra mile, you can even share it on Facebook, and that would be super. Um, but yeah, uh, with that said, you know, just don't sweat the small stuff, just sweat the calories, guys. Have yourself a good night.